get a straight. Yep. Yeah, welcome back to the channel, everybody. Um, today, we're going to be building a new and improved plane with the uh, Mechanics Mayhem Overhaul. Yeah, it does look like a simple design, but I'm telling you, it works like a charm. It's, it, it is amazing. So I'm going to show you how to make it today. And uh, yeah, so we're going to start off by firstly placing down some of these large wooden foundations so you have a nice flat area to work with. Then you want to head over to the uh, toy section and grab the large car jacks. Here they are. Alright. You're going to pull one there. You just pull one like in the same inline. About that far away. Should, should it work? You then want to head over to the general area and grab a medium dynamic foundation and just start uh, nudge it until it uh, fits like that. Now you want to grab your large thrusters and you're just going to put them pretty much hugging the uh, jack to make sure they are in the middle. That's in the middle. Make sure it's in the middle as well. Alright. This has to be, everything has to be even in this build, otherwise it won't fly properly. So once you've evenly placed these, you want to head up to the top and grab some more large thrusters. You then want to put, yeah, if they're even, you want to put two on the back. Actually, you want to move them, bring them down, bring them down so they're in the middle. You don't want them overhanging. Can't get this placement right. There we go. There we go. All right, nice and even. Once you've done that, you want to head over to your uh, building parts section. You can either you can either use wood foundations or uh, granite, but I'm going to be using granite just because I like the look. Yeah, I'm going to place these, and that's perfect. That should break. So now you have a nice flat surface and the thrusters below will still be there. Now you want to head over to the thruster section once again and put a large thruster only on one side of the wing, right? We only want one, so that's going to be our turning one. Then you want to grab a small uh, driver's seat. Now you can put a chuck a bed Chuck it on the end here. And then you can place some chests. So you want some storage on the plane, you can put chests. You can put more than I've put, but you have to even out the plane and uh, use balloons. More balloons than I use. Alright, so once you've done that, this isn't compulsory, but I just like to put some like lights and a, and a bumper to make it look to make it look a bit uh, aesthetic. If looks doesn't bother you, you can uh, leave these out. <coughs> All right. Now you can head to your balloons. Uh, you only need two small balloons for this build. And yeah, there you have it. You have your um, plane. So I'm going to show you how it works. Oh, before we do take off, you want to head over and grab a wrench. And then you're gonna, these are the settings you're gonna do. So for the first thruster on the wing, you want it to be channel one. And make sure you deselect channel three. Now, for the back two, you want it channel two. And the bottom ones will be on channel three automatically, so you don't have to change them. And now you're ready to fly. So it does take a little bit of getting used to. Before we do fly, I wanna just sleep in the bed so we can spawn here. There we go. Right, so it does take a little bit of getting used to to uh, actually figure out how to fly this thing, but you're going to put your bottom thrusters on first to get you up in the air, turn them off, and then put the back thrusters on. Oh, I actually forgot to program one of them. <laughs> Give me a second. Right, put that channel two. There we go. All right. So as I was saying, you want to start off with the uh, bottom thrusters, turn them off, then put the back thrusters on. And not do that. It should balance itself out. There we 
go. Just keep mucking around. I actually pressed the wrong button. You gotta just keep mucking around till you get it. So see, I've, I've placed the thrusters wrong. I've placed the thrusters wrong. So see how I haven't evenly spaced them down on the bottom? Try to fix that up. If you do make a mistake like that, all you need to do is grab a few more balloons. Probably need like two more. Hopefully it doesn't go too high. And shouldn't go too high. If it does, just build up to it. Right, he's got to fix this out. Fix this up. Yeah, so I did a really bad job on the lining these thrusters up. Yeah, so if you can try and get it even as possible, it helps. Once you've done that, I know this is going to be hard in survival, but bear with me. Uh, if you do, make sure you double check it a few times while it's still on the uh, card jacks. But once everything's all even, <laughs> we can start again. You can press the bottom thrusters up, and then press the back thrusters. You can go higher, just press the... You just got to figure it out. Muck around until you figure it out. And you can also steer. It works perfectly. Yeah, you got storage, you can go up if there's a hill. You just gotta tap the uh, bottom thrusters to go up. If you hold them down, you might flip it. But yeah, as you can see, it works pretty good. And then to land, you turn all the thrusters off, and then you'll gradually fall down to the ground. Now I did make this plane works like a charm, mate. I balanced it out perfectly and it just flies beautifully. I'll show you. There we go straight. Yep. And yeah, it's just a really oops. I was about to say it's a really smooth ride, but Nothing, nothing goes wrong with these things. It's a really good design. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy. And um, yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe.